We got a stalemate there. Nunez had a great shot in on his opponent, Yarnell, from Olathe, but couldn't suck it in there. I have Cameron home from Wiggins on the 2A side coming up soon, and also Keegan Mann at 126 pounds. Don't see them up there yet. Ray's just about to get reversed here. Nunez just got taken down. It'll be down two to nothing. Right at the end of the first period. Yep. It'll be Yarnell's choice. He defers to Nunez. Nunez going to take the neutral position after he just got taken down. Ray yep. gave up an escape start the second period to. Uh, his opponent, that's uh, Lou Carrera. Carrera up three to nothing as they go on their feet. Oswaldo Nunez down two to zero here in the second period. And a shot by Yarnell. Good sprawl by Nunez. Trying to get underneath and cross space. Yarnell has a good single leg hooked up though. Trying to pull it in. Nunez lifting up on the elbow. Oh, and Bray just got taken down again. Nunez trying to keep his weight in. Now trying to come around behind. Gets Yarnell down on his belly. Nunez just needs to get a good cross face in there and spin around behind and he'll get the takedown. Yarnell now looks like he's trying to hit a Peterson. Nunez, Nunez may have a cradle there, dude. Looks like he's trying to put a cradle on, but I don't know where he's going to go with it. Uh, Yarnell with a, does get that Peterson and comes through on Nunez. Nunez gets his legs back around. Yarnell driving through him. Gets the ankle of Nunez. Nunez, oh, not a, didn't give up the takedown yet, but he's down on his belly and. Yarnell grabbing that arm, and there's the takedown for Yarnell, and he's up four to zero on Nunez. Ray's giving up, giving up some more points. He's down five to nothing as they go out of bounds. And Nunez is done in the second period. It's going to be Yarnell's choice. And he's going to choose down, leading 4-0 to zero over Oswaldo Nunez. Ray's working on his feet here in the third period. Down by five. Oh, Nunez got a headlock. He needs to get an arm in there. Oh, Yarnell gets out of that. Now oh, just a side drag by Nunez, and somehow Yarnell comes up on top and puts... Nunez on his back. <clears throat> and Yarnell's going to be up 8-0 to zero here in the third period. Josh Beret down, Beret down 5 to nothing, And uh, we'll call a stalemate and send him back to the center. Nunez's opponent's only a freshman. He's wrestling uh, like a varsity, like he's got a lot more experience. Matt number four, Keegan Mann, is underway for Sedgwick County Fleming. On the whistle, a Granby roll by Nunez comes up to his feet, and Yarnell's going to trip him out of bounds. Bray's still down five to nothing. So about a about a minute left in Nunez's match. He's down eight to zero. Oh, and Yarnell puts Nunez in a cradle. Going to pick up two more points. Nunez spins out of that, tries to throw Yarnell, and just about ends up on his back. 
It's going to be 12 to 1 the score. Josh Perry is going to go down 5 to nothing to Lou Carrera from Faith Christian. 25 seconds left in the match. And that's going to be the end of the match as Yarnell.